Hey, what's up guys? Jerry here, aka Barnacles, and I'm usually well known for making incredibly long videos on YouTube, and a lot of people complain about it. But today we're gonna go the opposite direction. I'm gonna create an incredibly short video showing you guys how to remove those pesky Windows Store applications installed on Windows 10 that Microsoft will not allow you to remove. Now when you go into settings and you open up apps and features, you're gonna notice a list and you can sort it in a couple of different ways, but you're gonna run across these apps that say Microsoft Corporation right here and you'll notice that you can't uninstall it. The uninstall button is grayed out. It just does a little animation, you can't move it or uninstall it. But if you click on another program, there you go, you can click the uninstall button. So why did Microsoft make it so that we can't uninstall these applications? And the problem is there's quite a bit of them. There's maps, messaging. There are so many apps in there that I personally don't want on my box and Microsoft seems to keep installing more. So I'm gonna show you guys what you gotta do. The first thing you need to do is open up PowerShell. So to open PowerShell, just click on the start menu and type PowerShell. And there you have it. Right click on it though and say run as administrator. You really want to run it as administrator because you need that privilege to be able to uninstall the applications. So to get a list of all the packages that are on the box, just type get space app X package and hit enter. That's gonna show you all of the packages that are installed on the box, but that's a lot of information. So we wanna narrow it down. Let's say we wanna remove the maps application. So if I move this out of the way, we got maps right here. You got move and uninstall, but anyways, it's called maps. So we're gonna pull up the PowerShell window here. We're gonna run the same command. You can just hit up arrow as the shortcut key. I'm gonna go ahead and put a pipe at the end of it, and then I'm gonna do find stir space maps. It didn't find anything. Well, it's case sensitive, so we're gonna do uppercase maps. And there it is. Those are the lines that contain the word maps. Now, what you wanna get is the full package name. See this right here where it says full package name? That's the one that you want. So grab that whole package name with your mouse, drag, and then right click the copy. And then what we're gonna type is instead of get, we're gonna type remove appx package and then at the end we're just going to do dash package and then we're going to dump the name now watch i'm going to drag this down so you guys can see it down here in the corner and we're going to push enter and you're going to see maps disappear you ready dun, 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 dun. and wait for it wait for it wait for it wait for it bam it's gone so now all you have to do is repeat that same step for any of the other applications you want to remove from the system and the Windows Store. Now I will mind you that some of them will not remove. You can actually remove the Windows Store itself too, but I don't recommend doing that because it could limit some of your abilities later on. But if you try to remove stuff like Cortana, of course it will tell you no, even though it shows up in that list. And that's because Microsoft embedded Cortana much deeper in the operating system so that you and I could not remove it. Microsoft really wants to steal our data and Cortana is the best way to get it. So of course they're gonna fight to keep that. And I will be having some videos in the future showing you guys how to mitigate that using your router or using other software to prevent Microsoft telemetry and some of your private data from being sent to Microsoft. So guys, keep an eye out on the channel. If you're brand new here, go check out some of my other videos. I do a lot of stuff on Windows 10, technology, 3D printing, carving, racing simulation, how to program computers, pretty much anything in the nerd genre. And I also have a live stream every morning at 8.30 a.m over on Twitch TV forward slash Barnacles. Now that's 8 a.m. Pacific time, just so you guys know, I keep forgetting, you know, it's the whole global thing, but you guys will have a lot of fun if you come over there. I talk about literally everything that I can think of in the morning right after waking up and having my coffee with you guys. Also, thank you for all your support over on patreon.com forward slash Barnacles. You guys have been absolutely amazing. With your support, I'm allowed to create more videos like this and do more live streams and dedicate more of my time trying to make content you love. So guys, it's your computer. Keep on fighting the power. You do what you want with your computer and tell Microsoft to go to hell. And I'm going to keep on giving you guys tips and tricks on how to circumvent their systems. Also, head over to at Barnacles on Twitter. I usually post there with the hashtag Tech Talk with all of these little pictures and, and what I just showed you in this video, I actually also tweeted to social media long before the video is published. So guys, I hope that covers everything. If you have any questions, leave them down in the comments or you can come over and tweet me. All right, guys, have a good one. And until next time. Hey, Microsoft, I choose what I want on my computer.